Hi guys, it's 11.23 on the 2nd of August. Yesterday, just down there, past the Caltech station, is where they were having that massive checkpoint. Well, as addition today, I'm not sure if you can see it. And here we have another speed camera fighting down there in these little doldrums. They like to do that. Shoot across the road. Ah, he's moving. Look at that. There he goes. Moving. Right, bye, buddy. ETL 813. Mr. Speed Camera. There he is. Just outside the dairy, parked at the same spot I just was in. better than bead hoy. He knows how to indicate this one. Didn't even go onto the side road like me. Oh no, he just does that. Okay, 
people. So there he is. Opens the side door. I'm going to go and be nice. I'm going to stop up the road a bit and slow everyone down. My theory is I'm going to sit here for probably 20-30 minutes, have a drink, warn all the oncoming traffic, let them know there's a dirty slimy speed camera, I'm not going to put any signs up, not today. So, yes. Look at him, it's absolutely despicable how much revenue New Zealand police are trying to pull out of this local community at the moment. And now we've got these fucking pirates robbing us blind. So, working out on my theory of a 7 hour day, 638 cars, 19,140 at a minimum of $30 a ticket. Um, Him and his buddies down the road there are um, literally 19,000 over seven hours. What's that? 2,000 an hour? Over 2,000 an hour? Almost well, two and a half thousand an hour. So, me just sitting here for half an hour should, in theory, save about 1,200 bucks. Um, I'm sure it'll be a lot more. But, um, yeah. So yeah, and now we've even got oncoming cars that are doing the tooting as well. How cool is that? So what do you reckon people? Is it fair enough that this guy should be stealing everybody's money? When clearly nothing is actually being done wrong. No man or woman is causing harm, loss, damage, injury to property or anything else. This is strictly an administrative thing. So, um, yeah, think about it, people. Some people might say, why are you wasting your time? Why are you doing all this? Well, I'm pretty sure the 20 or 30 odd people I've probably just saved from getting a speeding ticket would argue otherwise. They'd say, fuck, we really enjoyed having those extra, you know, 10 or 12 loaves of bread on our food, you know, on our table to eat as opposed to giving it to some administrative fee, you know? Think about it. For fuck's sake, I'm getting so fed up with people thinking they're a person and that they're obliged in some way to their fellow man when no man has any fucking right to demand fuck all from any other man unless there's consent contract or an agreement between parties. You know, it's real fucking simple. I'm sure that man there is getting paid for his efforts. I'm not. But they're 
mean, I'll consider this my good deed for the day. If I get their attention and make them slow down, I will. And yep, it's a game because everything's a game. Life's a game. Sorry. You know, people might be asking me, why don't you um why don't you just pull up behind him in a big truck? I think um oh Tony Meehan, great guy from England, um asked me that question once. You know, why don't you just pull up behind him in a big truck? Block his view. Well, over here, the annual retentive men that believe they have some fucking authority over other men, um, or others of mankind, um, don't really give a fuck. Um, they would ring up their bully boys and say, oh, I'm feeling threatened. Or they'd just move. Either way. Stop this side too and let a few know. And I'll put a Pepsi challenge out there to all of you people. Anyone that goes past a speed camera and doesn't agree with them, take five minutes out of your day. Just five minutes. Because in five minutes, in one minute, um, three cars can get clicked. So take five minutes out of your day. Let 15 or 20 or 30 cars know that the speed camera you just went past is there. Once, once you've done that, take solace in knowing that 15 or 20 cars at a minimum of $30 a ticket, you just save, save some, you know, some lovely people $450, $600 to stop you getting robbed by pirates on the side of the road. So, that's my Pepsi challenge for you all. See if you um, see if you agree. If you don't, put your comments down the bottom. If you agree with me, put your comments down the bottom. If you don't, opinions vary. I'm happy to hear any. Um, not that I give a fuck about what anybody else's opinion is, because it doesn't make any difference to me. But um, yeah, I'm always curious. Later. Bye, guys. Have a good one.